Hi, I'm Tim Carter with AskTheBuilder.com, and today I'm installing a Leviton SmartLock Pro GFCI receptacle, and I want to share with you why this product is an ideal solution for helping to keep you safe from dangerous and potentially fatal electrical shock hazards. GFCIs are time-tested electrical receptacles that have been used by builders, electricians, and homeowners alike for decades to prevent dangerous electrical shocks resulting from ground faults. Because of the protection they provide, GFCIs are required by the National Electric Code to be installed in wet or damp locations. This includes every bathroom, kitchen, laundry room, basement, garage, deck, or patio, anywhere water might potentially mix with electricity. The Leviton SmartLock Pro GFCI is so easy to install. Its slim profile takes up to 25% less space in a standard electric box than other brands. And the extra room makes it easier to attach wires to the receptacle with the option of inserting them straight in under the clamp or wrapping them around the terminal screw. Simply tighten the standard screws to secure the wires. I love the clean and modern look. You'll notice it doesn't stick out beyond the cover plate like some other GFCIs. This Leviton SmartLock Pro GFCI receptacle, it's got a very critical safety feature. If for some reason inside the device the ground fault protection is lost, no matter how many times you try to press the reset button, it's not going to reset. This is a really reassuring feature for any electrician or homeowner like you. Leviton GFCIs come in a variety of formats. From weather resistant to guide light, you can visit the homedepot.com or in store to find all of them. On a personal note, I've installed thousands of Leviton switches and receptacles in my homes and on my jobs. Why? It's simple. The Leviton switches and receptacles, they've never let me down. That's a true sign of quality and performance. I'm Tim Carter with AskTheBuilder.com. Thanks for watching. If you want to discover more home improvement tips, go to AskTheBuilder.com.